I remember the day when I was playing farm lockdown zone, spawning on the west side, trade center, and a random guy ran from the road with a deagle. He didn't even shoot at me. I shot that guy and I saw he was ace. I was super proud. I mean, I felt like, oh my God. Oh my God, I killed an ace player. Back then it felt to be a big achievement, so I set myself as a goal to reach ace in this season. I even published a video after reaching ace to help you guys, to support you guys achieving the same because I'm not like a highly professional player. I didn't really play with T6 armor, helmet and high-end guns. And after I achieved ace, I felt like, Going up to legend, guys, is impossible. The reason I thought I'm never gonna be legend is because above ace, you're not getting any points for extracting or killing bots. So it's just purely for killing enemy players. And depending on their rank, you get different amount of points. So I felt like that, okay, it's gonna be even harder because I'm gonna face more ace and legend players. But then something changed here in my head. I started to believe that I can actually reach legend. You should never underestimate your enemies, but if you have a boosted self-confidence, you just play differently. You play more aggressively and with a style where you can surprise the enemies and force them to be afraid of you. And after Armory Rush has been introduced, I boost myself up to Ace 4 and that was the changing point. That was the milestone where I knew that I'm gonna hit legend. So I did. There are so many topics to cover, guys. Mindset, how to play aggressively, how to loot specific maps, how to play solo, how to play with a specific gun. There are many, many things I can show you and I hope they're gonna support you along the way to reach Master, Ace and then Legend because I feel that even as a casual player, Legend is not impossible. The message what I wanna deliver is that I'm gonna keep producing content with the mindset that you as a viewer most likely don't have the Said skills or the Yusuf skills. And we need to find strategies, we need to find ways of play the game that brings us up to legend and makes us successful without having to grind like 24 seven or without having experience in PUBG Metro for five years or whatever. If I had to name the three most important things you need to focus on to be successful, and I think first one would be controls and don't like copy sensitivity and control settings from pro players. No, do your own settings and then adjust it and then polish it. Go to the training ground and then improve it. If you feel something is not right, then change it and then get used to it. And even within controls, it's movement, peeking, zooming and, and basically firing. The second most important thing I would say is map awareness and understanding the enemy's movement and then adjusting your movement to theirs to be in a better position. I know it was super long, but basically it means that if you have a good sense of where your enemies are, then most likely you're gonna make the right choices. You're gonna position yourself in a way that you are going to be the one spotting them first and firing first. And the third most important thing I would want you to keep in mind is that don't have that fear of losing stuff. Uh, it's gonna hinder you. It's gonna make you a bad player because you're not going to be able to play the game in a way where you are the one coming out alive of the fights. And I'm not saying that you should play tactical ops like you play covert ops because most players in covert ops, they don't care. They just run and they want to get a lucky kill. That's perfectly fine. But try to find a balance like somewhere in between where you are not sitting in the corner and holding your AKM or FAL or M4 or whatever and you know just hope that somebody is gonna walk into your crosshair it's not gonna happen on on on, on master and ace level every single player wants to stay alive and they're gonna do their very best performance and many players have an insanely nice aim i died so many times because of that 0.1 second like i 
and by the time I spot the enemy, I'm already dead. And it still happens to ace players and legend players. The fact that somebody reaches ace or legend, it doesn't mean that they are not able to die. In the last couple of days, I killed multiple legend players. And yes, there is a difference between like expert and master level compared to legend. They are somewhat harder to fight, but it doesn't mean that you cannot shoot them. So you shouldn't be afraid of them. Basically, that's what I'm trying to say. In terms of game style, it's really hard to give you one specific recommendation. I think the scariest way of playing the game is if you are being super aggressive, especially if you have a team you know, with FAS, M4s and flashlights and then rushing the enemy because they're going to be scared. They are going to do mistakes, but you can also be a camper. You can sit on Valley or North Ridge with your sniper alone and then hunt the enemies. That's the beauty of this game. You can actually play the game for months without ever entering Northridge or Valley or Armory and you can still enjoy the game. Every single map needs to be played differently. You need to have different skills on port compared to Valley, for example, and it's up to you. Nobody forces you to play shotguns if you don't like shotguns. Same for snipers and so on. Nobody's forcing you to play dum-dums if you don't wanna aim at legs. I, I, I don't like that, for example. So it's pretty much up to you to evolve your own playstyle. Don't try to be good at everything with every single gun on every single map. It just doesn't make sense. So guys, this was my story on how I became legend, sprinkled with a bit of tips and sharing my thoughts. So if you wanna reach ASO legend, then please subscribe to my channel. Keep watching my videos because I'm not gonna change my mindset. This is the first FPS game I ever played on mobile. And I know that for casual players, like legend level seems to be impossible, but it's not, it's not, you can do it. And I'm gonna support you to get to the rank where you wanna be. Thank you guys for the attention. Thank you for the support. Thank you for all the comments I'm getting from you. And as always, I'm wishing you a nice day. Happy looting guys, Shady out, bye.